Hi guys, welcome back to at least 2 minutes video channel. Today's topic is Big Data. Big Data is one of the pillars of Industry 4.0. If you're not sure what is Industry 4.0, you may click on the link on the top right corner or in the description below. If you want to know the latest video that we're uploading, click on the subscribe and the bell button below. Before going into Big Data, let's understand the meaning of Big. According to Cambridge Dictionary, Big is defined as large in size or amount. Next, let's understand the meaning of data. And no, you're not in the matrix. Cambridge Dictionary stated that data is defined as information such as facts or numbers that are collected to be examined and considered and used to assist on decision making or information in an electric form that can be stored and used by a computer. So what is big data? According to Ishwarappa and Anuradha on their publication A Brief Introduction on Big Data 5V's Characteristic and Hadoop Technology, Big data is defined as a compilation of huge and complex data sets and data volume that include the huge quantities of data, data management, capabilities, social media analytics, and real-time data. Here are an example of companies that provide big data solution and services are IBM, Google, Oracle, and VMware. Ishwarappa and Anuradha also mentioned that big data has five characteristics, which are volume, Velocity, value, veracity, and lastly, variety. Let's move on to the first characteristic, which is volume. A lot of companies have large amount of archive data in the form of logs, but do not have the capacity to crunch the data. Furthermore, processing large amount of information is the main attraction of big data analytics. Volume consists of terabytes of data, records and archives, transaction, and tables and files. The next characteristic of big data is velocity. Velocity is defined as the speed at which new data is generated and speed at which data moves around. Velocity depends on batch, real or near-time data, processes, and streams. Next is the third characteristic and the most crucial aspect in big data is value. In order to store big data, the implementation of IT infrastructure is going to be very costly and the organization is going to require a return on investment. Value compromises of statistical data, events, correlation between one data and another, and lastly, hypothetical. The fourth characteristic of big data is veracity. When we're dealing with a huge volume, velocity, and variety of data, it is important that we are capturing quality data. Furthermore, the accuracy of the analysis depends on the veracity of the source data. The veracity of the data needs to come from a trustworthiness source, authenticity, accountability, origin and reputation, and lastly, the availability of the data. The last characteristic of big data is variety. Variety consists of structured and unstructured data that is crucial to big data. However, dealing with variety of structured and unstructured data greatly increases the complexity of both storing and analyzing the big data. Types of variety data are structured, unstructured, multi-factor, and probabilistic. By using big data, we are able to conduct predictive analytics. This analytic uses the current model to forecast what might happen in a specific scenario. For an example, predictive analytics are forward-looking, model application, and non-discrete forecasting. Another use of big data is prescriptive analytics. This technique is the most valuable and underused technique. This analytics give you laser-like focus to answer specific questions. Example of prescriptive analytics are forward-looking, optimization and decision rules for future events, and focus on optimal decision for future situations. You're probably wondering, so what's the advantages and disadvantages of big data? According to datamation.com, the advantages of big data are better decision making, increased productivity, and it reduces cost. Furthermore, datamation.com also mentioned that the disadvantages of big data are company needs to hire new talents, company needs to upgrade their hardware, and lastly, company may face security risk. Join us on our next video. The next pillar that we're going to talk about is autonomous robots. So what are your thoughts on big data? Write your comments below. If you enjoyed this video, leave a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel.